Hey, this is Dr. Sam, the Health Raiser, and today I want to help you raise your level of health up by talking to you about the VIP of health. That's right, the VIP of health. Now, the first VIP is you. That's right, you are a VIP. You are a very important person, and as such, you have an important role playing this planet. Each of us has gifts and talents. Each of us has been blessed with something that we can give back to the world. This is what I call our earth worth. Our earth worth is the value we bring and deliver to the world through our gifts and talents. And so you are a VIP. You are a very important person. And as such, it's very important that you take good care of your health. Because when you do that, you'll be able to express your gifts and talents at the highest level possible. Okay. So the next VIP of health is that your health is a very important possession. That's right. Your health is sacred. It is absolutely sacred. Have you ever heard that expression that the body is a temple and that it's very sacred? Well, there's some truth to that, but you have to want to treat it that way. And then it will definitely become a very sacred thing. So that brings us to our final VIP of health. Now the V is for value, okay? And your health is your wealth. It is the greatest asset you own. I can't think of a more valuable thing than your health. Because when you think about it, without your health, you really don't have much. You know all those things people value like their houses or their cars or their boats or their computers or all the other things they value. First, what good are any of those things if you can't even enjoy any of those things because your health is not in a good place? Now, I was actually blessed to grow up in a household who taught health principles. Okay, Now, these health principles had a lot of value. And at the time, I used to just think, ah, maybe my parents were being tough on me or kind of nagging me a little bit. But looking back, I see how blessed I really was because they stress the importance of getting to bed on time and staying properly hydrated and getting outside and getting fresh air and sunshine and exercise and spending time with friends and family and people that you love. These things were really important. So growing up, I even though I took them for granted a little bit, I did value them. And later in life, I realized how valuable they are because I still rely on those things, knowing that those are the things that are most sacred to me because they will bring me a lot of happiness and joy in my life. That's because I've learned to truly value them. And I think it's sad that as a whole, as society, people don't value health. That is not until they lose it, okay, right? Think about it. It's a time that somebody can't walk anymore, or they're not breathing well, or their liver shutting down, right? Or they just can't think straight. Then, and only then, maybe they start to value their health a little bit then they'll actually start to put a price tag on their health. Now, I gotta tell you, health is invaluable. It's priceless. It's really important that you value your health because it is valuable, but only if you value it, right? You have to put the value into it in order to value it. Think about the Hope Diamond. All it is is a big shiny rock, but why do people think it's so valuable? Because they've put value on it. So put value on your health and then you'll value it. Okay, the next one is the I, all right? And the I in this VIP is invest. You have to invest in your health on an ongoing basis. Yes, it requires some time, money, and energy. But the good news is it really doesn't require that much. That's the beauty of mother nature. She returns tenfold on your investment. And Health is always an awesome ROI. Now on any investment in your life, you wanna look at what the ROI is. ROI stands for your return on investment, okay? Now, with your health, the ROI is magnificent because it will continue to return you the most valuable thing in the world, which is to have a happy and healthy life. See, because your quality of health helps to determine the quality of your life. And that's why it's such a great investment. And it really is a low risk, high reward investment. Meaning that you don't have a lot of risk when you invest in your health. 
other than if you don't invest in it. If you don't invest in it, there's a great risk. You're at risk of a heart attack. You're at risk of a stroke. You're at risk of your kidney shutting down. You get where I'm going with this. So overall though, it is a very low risk. You don't really have to put too much into it. And when you think about it, the cost of health really isn't that much most of the time. A lot of the things that make you healthy, such as breathing correctly or getting sleep or enough exercise or sunshine or fresh air, these things are free. They don't cost anything. However, they're costly if you choose to ignore them. All right, and finally, the P in the VIP is protect. See, once you start to value your health and you invest in your health and you see how sacred it is, then you're gonna wanna protect it. You're gonna wanna protect it because Basically, it's your life, or at least it's your quality of life. So the more that you protect it, the more that you're ensuring and assuring that you have a high quality of life. And this, my friends, is truly priceless because this will allow you to express your greatest gifts and talents with the world. And this will also allow you to save tons of time, money, energy, and suffering and live the life you want because you can now invest those things into hanging out with the people you want to hang out with, doing the things you want to do, and truly living a happy, fulfilled, enjoyable life. So I hope that this served to motivate you today and make you rethink how you look at your health and value your health. And again, my name is Dr. Sam, aka The Health Razor, and I'm wishing you much love.